Hello, today let's solve these two integrals, and we will frequently use the result of these two integrals in future video. So let's get started. We begin with the cosine integral. First, we define x equals half pi minus theta, so cosine x equals sine theta, and dx equals minus d theta. Plug in the substitution. Then we use a minus sign to flip the lower and upper limit. So these two integrals are equal. We define them as a capital I. Then we add them together. We group them into a single integral. Using the property of the logarithm function, we can write the sum into the product. Recall the double angle formula for the sum function. After replace the sum times cosine term, we got here. Next, we make a substitution. Plug in the substitution. Note for the upper limit is converted into pi. We take the one half out of the integral and write the logarithm function into the subtraction. I copy them here. We multiply 2 on both sides and split the right hand side into two integrals. And we integrate this term. Then we add this purple colored term on both sides. So they cancel out. I copy it here. Next, we split the right hand side into two parts, from 0 to half pi and from half pi to pi. If we compare this term with the original problem, they are the same. So we replace it with a capital I. Now we combine these two parts and cancel the capital I. Next, we define u equals half pi plus theta. So sin u equals cosine theta and du equals d theta. Plug in the substitution. And note for the lower and upper limit, they are converted here. If we compare this integral with the original problem, they are the same. So we replace this integral with a capital I. After solving this equation, we got the final answer. And don't forget to subscribe my channel and give a like.